Welcome back. In this video, we will talk about the anatomy and significance of Hesselbach Triangle. Hesselbach Triangle is the area just above the pubic bone, and it's the main differentiating feature between direct and indirect inguinal hernia. If an abdominal organ or tissue herniates through the triangle, we call this a direct hernia. And if it's outside the triangle, we call it an indirect hernia. The area has three sides, which is why it's a triangle. On the bottom side, we have a linguinal ligament. On the medial side, we have the rictus abdominis muscle. And on the lateral side, we have the inferior epigastric artery. The inferior epigastric artery is also a differentiating feature between direct and indirect inguinal hernia. If the hernia was on the medial side of the artery, it has to be inside the triangle, so it's direct. And if it was on the lateral side, it will be indirect. And here's a small quiz for you. Which of the following is a content of the inguinal canal? And here's the answer. Alright guys, that's all I have. Thank you so much for watching.